Dan Perry here again, and this is part 26 of our TCP IP basics. I will be finishing up the TCP headers in this video. Uh, again, we're continuing our examination of the TCP header, <coughs> uh, review of the format of the header, and up to this point we have been looking at the sequencing acknowledgments and flags, and now we're going to start looking at the uh, window size. Uh, the window size, it's also called the sliding window. The sliding window basically uh, is a way of controlling the amount of data that's sent before an acknowledgement has to be received. <clears throat> if we had to do an acknowledgement for every packet that we sent, transmission would be very slow. It would be uh, such as if I said hello, and you had to say, okay, how, I said how, and then you say, okay, are, then you have to say okay after every word I say our conversations would really be slow so the window size basically says okay you can send several words before I have to acknowledge so I could say hello how are you today okay well how's the weather today okay and by adjusting that window size the and it's controlled on the receiving end if the, the receiving end can handle data more quickly, if it can process that data, it would increase the window size when it sends an acknowledgement. Therefore, the sender would know, okay, I can send more data before I receive the acknowledgement. Uh, if the receiver starts getting congested, it can reduce that window size and then there will be less traffic sent before it. Um, if we start getting a lot of errors, uh, that window size will be slowed down uh, or made smaller so that uh, we send less data between acknowledgments as well. Um, the checksum, it it's not, doesn't really do um, total error detection. It checks the header and data to, uh, uh, to see there. Uh, I, I probably shouldn't say detection. It does detect errors. It doesn't... Uh, <clears throat> It doesn't do any error correction in there. Uh, when a segment's received with an error, the, the segment is not acknowledged. So you receive a data segment. It looks at the header and data. It computes the checksum, compares it to the checksum field. If they're different, then the uh, segment is not acknowledged. So then it will be retransmitted uh, because the uh, sender did not receive the acknowledgement. Uh, next time we're going to look at our uh, UDP headers uh, and uh, then we'll move into our uh, IP uh, headers. <clears throat>